The dishes we've got on the menu today are out of this world, which is just as well, as joining us in the caf is the new Doctor Who herself. It's Jodie Whittaker, everyone! Hello, you lovely girl. How are you? I'm good, thanks. I'm excited. So you survived out here. I nearly took off. Yeah. Did you not want to come in the TARDIS? I mean, you I know, know, you could have just landed over there. I know, I'm still not sick of those gags yet, you no, know. It won't be long. <laughs> <laughs> But, I mean, everyone knows Doctor Who. It is iconic, and yeah. it's gone global, hasn't it? Yeah. I mean, and I haven't had to do any of the hard work. There's a fan base in place for 55 years. Was it quite daunting, getting that role? It's a weird one, because, of course, it's daunting, because it's got this history. But, weirdly, it's an easier thing for me to step into, because I'm the first woman. So, you know, there's probably less pressure on me than maybe Matt or Peter and David taking yeah. over. I could be someone's first doctor, yeah. and that's an honour and really kind of overwhelming. If this is the biggest thing I'm ever going to do, I'm, I'm, I'm OK with that. When did you know, I mean, was it when you were a little girl, that acting was your thing? Oh, I was just... I was really attention-seeking. <laughs> and I... I was, like, At least I just, you're being honest about this. Really, really being honest. I, like, you know, and like, everything to me was... was playing. Well, your folks really supported then, Yeah, you? 100%, because for them, it was something that their child was passionate about. How are your parents about it now? Because a dream came true, right? You've played yeah. some amazing roles. Yeah, but my dad's delighted I'm in something he's heard of now. <laughs> so it's like, there's so many films I've done over the years, I like little indies, that he's like, do I have to watch that? Yes, you do. You do. Whereas now, he's heard of it, so he's, he's delighted. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so, so tell me about you and food growing up, Mum's cooking. I mean, are there things that stick out? She is an absolute beyond five-star mother. Yeah. I wouldn't give her a five-star rating on cooking. Oh, really? <laughs> really? What was her kind of go-to meal that she would so cook for you? So we would have this really amazing spaghetti bolognese. <laughs> And then I remember when I had a huge craving for it as an adult. I was like, Mum, I need you to tell me. I need you to tell me how to make it. And I was devastated. <laughs> it is minced meat, um, a tin of tomatoes in it, onion, a tub of single cream, and half a bottle of squeezy ketchup. <laughs> and it's amazing. It's amazing. I've, I've never heard that method it's before. Amazing. So. Is there anything that she did that you would be proud of? Oh, Yorkshire pudding. Oh, Yorkshire Absolute, pudding. Absolutely, yeah. And a proper, a proper But that's worst. kind of, that's a bit like genetics, really, it's, isn't I mean, it? As a Yorkshire really person. Good, yeah. <laughs> yeah, really good, really good Sunday dinner. The roast dinner that I've cooked for these guys today is Anglo-American in style. Roast dinner? Yeah. Are you hungry? Yeah. I'm absolutely starving. Give me a little moment. So exciting. Uh, you're going to have about four dinners today. Oh, yeah, do I need to pace myself? We all wear elastic trousers, so just go with the front. Made a right air up on Spanx. <laughs> <laughs> Have a little tuck in. Oh, my God, I can't wait. Oh, my God. Just that is beautiful. That is ace, that sauce there. It's just beautiful. It, like, it just works. It's beautiful. All right, girl. I just want to remind you that it's not all play today. You have to do a little bit of work. How's your waitressing skills? My waitressing skills are phenomenal. My cooking skills are below par. Okie dokie. Uh, guys, you hungry? Yeah! All right, girl, no pressure. Mm. Right. Remember, don't pick at the cracking when you're serving like someone. Like that? Yep. That ain't gonna happen. <laughs>